Everybody, everybody, rock your bodies, back streets back, all right? We are gonna get right down to business today. Hello, Crash Andrews, by the way. By the way, we're gonna get right down to business today because it's time to continue our franchise with the Bastin Bruins. After season one took uh, five minutes and then season two took forever and a day with us sending everybody uh, back to the teams they belong on. We are here. Season two. Spoilers. Playoffs. Leafs. In round one. So we're going to be on our way to round two. Is uh, the joke everyone was saying yesterday. We will indeed see if that is the case. However, a friendly reminder, Patrice Bergeron is hurt. <laughs> so this is the team that we are carrying in the round one. It's Marshawn, Steen, Pasternak, Hall, Kopp, DeBrusque, Hall, Coyle, Smith, Foligno, Frederick, and Stud. The defense, Lindholm, McAvoy, Grizzly, Carlo, Riley, and Clifton, Dima Dima. Thank you for the raid, and how did your stream go? Swayman and Allmark. We're going to give Sway the chance. But yeah, no Patrice Bergeron, which uh, kind of sucks. At 37 years old, if we were to lose in round one, that could be it for his career. And I would cry. I would cry. By the way, the other playoff matchups, you have Calgary and L.A., Edmonton, Anaheim, Nashville, Vegas, St. Louis, Dallas. The Atlantic, again, is Florida, Philly, New York, Ottawa, Washington, and New Jersey. The Leafs, the laughs, they look like this. Yeah. Nylander, Matthews, Marner, Bunting, Tavares, and Nick Robertson. Cousins, Camp, Bozak, Clifford, I believe it's Abrazizi? Abrazizi? Abrazizi. I'm going to go with Abrazizi. And Joey Anderson. They did get Tyler Bozak back, as they should. As they should. Defensively is Sandine, Liljegren, Brody, Riley, Mete, Schultz. So, uh, that's a third pair, but at least Sandine and Liljegren finally panned out, huh? Goaltender, Peter Morazic. With Joe Wall. No injuries, but uh, SDA, Semyon, Darkajinsev, Andre Kasha, and Alex Kerfoot are scratches that... Is a pretty expensive, healthy scratch in the form of Alex Kerfoot. Yikes. Yikes, indeed. Let's do this, chat. It is our first ever playoff series at the helm of the Boston Bruins. And we'll leave it up to you guys. A prediction is up. Toronto-Boston. Let's go. Game number one in Toronto. Let's see what we can do. First period. Goalless, the complete antithesis of Game 1 Edmonton-Calgary. Good lord. Second period, 2-1 Boston. Matthews scored the opening goal. Two goals, though, from David Pasternak. A minute and six seconds apart. Give your Bruins the lead. We go to the third, where Nick Robertson ties it very quickly. Brad Marchand scores. 3-2. We're out playing them. Only up by one. If you lose, you delete the save file for unrealistic stimming. Fair. Fair enough. We'll go switch to the Islanders again. Are we going to hold on? Yes, we are. 3-2 is the final. Brad Marchand scores the winning goal of game one. Nick, what's up? I had a pretty solid day. I had a pretty solid day. No complaints. It's going to be even better if Marshawn and Pasternak keep playing like that. It's going to be even better. It's a beautiful thing. Game number two. We'll jump right into it. No need to change anything with the Lions or anything like that. Let's rock. First period is goalless again. Two straight, uh, two straight games. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. And guess you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long It hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray As you fade away 
Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby I have a taste All the highs and the lows no, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never fell this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way Trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away to the third down by two not great not great anybody want to score anybody at all now's now's your time now's your chance anybody at all nope it's another shutout 
for Peter Morazic. <laughs> And the Leafs have a 3-1 to one lead. They have won three straight games. I, I, I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying to find the words. And I, uh, I don't have them at the moment. <sighs> this is, Patrice, come back, please. We need you. Going to be Allmark in game five. We're going to take out Connor Clifton for Derek Forbert. Maybe. Lindholm's been terrible. Riley hasn't done a damn thing offensively. Matt Grizzlick has also been terrible. All of this sounds rather accurate. <sighs> Fuck it. Let's do what dumb Bruins fans like and scratch Mike Riley. Who says no? Forward line, forward wise. Let's be honest. We are, we're just boned. We're boned. Let's put Andrew Cop on the top line. We'll kind of roll, but they somewhat close. Set. At least the middle six is accurate to what the Bruins, uh, Bruins, the Bruins, to what the Bruins rolled with. But yeah, for the most part, we're probably boned. If you get goalied by Morazic, <laughs> here we go. Game number five. We lose. We are out. Let's see what happens. First period, 2-0 Toronto. <laughs> Nylander and Matthews. What game is this? I thought this was game five, not game four. Okay. Sure. Sure. Second period, now 3-2. Pasternak and DeBrusque for us. Matthews has the difference maker right now as we go to the third period. It's not looking good for us. Power play. Matt Grizzlick. Grizz getting it done. Tying it up. Justin Schultz. Justin Schultz, Brad Marshawn. We're going to overtime, baby. We're going to overtime. It is an elimination situation. Will there be a handshake? Will there be a handshake or will there be a game six in Baston? We're going to find out. Justin Schultz. Justin Schultz opens the door. Says, hello, how are you? And now is our opportunity to hopefully not screw this up, please. Please don't screw this up, please. Please, boys, do not screw this up. I believe in you. I do. Here's Andrew Kopp with speed. Copper. Hands off to Pasternak for no reason. Marshawn, shot, kick saved by Morazic. It's William Nylander for the Leafs. Toe drag, pass to Marner, nearly scored. It's Kopp. Shot, gloved by Morazic. That was really weird. He went, like, cross-body glove save. Oh, McAvoy. Up there and hits. I don't care. We need to be, we need to be up there and wins, preferably. Face-off won by Matthews. It's Austin Matthews. Making moves. Takes the shot, Allmark. Takes it to the chest. Job, Linus. Fifty-five. Man, we're losing the face-off battle too. God, I knew we were missing Bergeron. I didn't think we'd be missing him that much. Jesus. Off the draw. Bruins have it. Pasta not. Come on, Pasta. Hands off for Marshawn. Bumped off the puck. Uh, your opinion on Bruins or have a Canadian zone? What, 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 what's my opinion on the Habs winning the first overall pick? Makes no difference to me. I don't pay attention to bad teams. Oh, God. Come on, boys. Come on. We're not out of this series until they score. 
Bosternock loses it. We just keep. We just keep. Oh, God, we're in season two. Matthews, Robertson, big shoulder save. Hampus, make the play. Okay, that wasn't really. Halla, make the play. We need a defensive pair change badly. McAvoy, do not turn that over. Halla, we can barely gain the zone. Taylor Hall, save. Taylor Hall, rebound scores. Taylor Hall forces a game six back in Baston. We survive elimination. Thanks to Taylor Hall. Peter Morazic way out of his crease, tried to poke check it away, and Hall had just enough of an angle to bank that one home. Allmark makes some big saves, including that one right there. But it is David Posternock, Taylor Hall and company getting it done. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we needed. 38th shot of the game. Close game. We survive it. Let's go lose on home ice in game six because I guarantee we build up all that momentum for nothing. That's typically what happens. Still no Patrice Bergeron. He's out until May 4th, and even then he won't be fully healthy until a few days after. All right. Game six. I mean, Allmark's got to be the guy. Allmark's got to be the guy. Both goalies have been... Actually, both goalies have been tragic. Uh, we're going Swayman. I might regret it. We're going with Jeremy Swayman, who's apparently also up to an 86 now. It is game number six. Let's do it. The Leafs had a 3-1 lead. It is now 3-2. Game six. First period. 1-0 Boston. David Bosternock. Beautiful Davis. Sweet, beautiful Davis. Give it a 33 months, friendo. And might I say, uh, the outcome of your uh, stream tonight, it, it's better than anything else that could have happened. So, <laughs> Second period. 2-0 Boston. Bruins legend, Andrew Kopp. We go to the third, 20 minutes away from potentially forcing game seven. Shorthanded goal for Craig Smith. Brad Marchand makes it 4 nothing. The Boston Bruins are going to battle back from 3-1 down to force game seven. In Toronto. 28 save shutout for Jeremy Swayman. It was meant to be. It was meant to be, everybody. It was meant to be. As the Providence Bruins eliminate the Lehigh Valley Phantoms, they'll be taking on the Bridgeport Not Sound Tigers. <sighs> Here we go. Swayman's going to be in. Devils over the Caps. Sends over the Rangers. And Flyers over the Panthers. We are the last series left in the East. And there's only one more series in the West as well. As the Flames, Gold Knights, and Blues all move on. Eli, what's going on? Here we go. It is Game 7. It was 3-1. Here it is. Here it is. Game 7. First period, 1-0 Boston Taylor Hall. Thank you for the bits there. Second period, still 1-0 Boston. We go to the third. Are the Leafs going to leaf it? 12 minutes to go. Halfway through the third. 7-6-5. Four, three, two minutes to go. If the Leafs are going to leaf it, we're going to watch it. 
Regardless, we're gonna see a handshake here in a few seconds. Maybe even minutes. Maybe even a dozen minutes, who the hell knows. This is happening. 59 seconds on the clock. 1-0 Boston. Game 7 in Toronto. The Leafs had a 3-1 series lead. Stud for Steen. And a penalty called on the Leafs. The Bruins go to the power play. Michael Bunting called for holding. So much for putting the whistles away. The, Bruins the power kill of the Leafs the with Tyler Bozak and David Camp. Steen can't win the draw. Mrazek forced to cover. And a few more seconds will tick off the clock. It was 3-1, it was everybody. It was 3-1. Beautiful. Oscar Steen again loses the draw. Brody turns it over. Pass across, Brody picks it off. Break away. Save. Rebound. Camp can't tuck it. Oh my god! 30 seconds to go! Empty net for Toronto! Pass up to Taylor Hall! Can he cut in? Picked off by Brody, it was going in! 17 seconds! Brody, Marner to Bozak! Cuts back, Bozak looking, pass interrupted, still fighting for it, Pasternak has it! Five seconds to go. The Boston Bruins. It was 3-1. Are going to eliminate the Leafs in game seven. Oh my God. TJ Brody had a breakaway. He was denied. And the Bruins come back to beat the Leafs. In game seven. It was 3-1. And the Leafs fall in round one. Oh my god. Who says this game's unrealistic? Who says? Craig Smith leading the way in the handshake line. Marchand. Handshakes. That's very unrealistic. The stands weren't empty. An incredible breakaway save by Jeremy Swayman. And right here it was Taylor Hall who ends it on an empty net right along the ice. Puck dies. And that's it. The Bruins win game seven. Beat him a very strong performance in terms of pure numbers. But the Boston Bruins. All they needed was Andrew Kopp, I'm telling you. Bruins win it in seven. We're moving on to round two. <laughs> God damn. Without Patrice Bergeron. Seven points for Marchand. Three for Kopp, seven for Pasta. Seven for Taylor Hall. Four for Hall and two for Jake DeBrusque. Trent Frederick didn't do a goddamn thing. Two points and a minus six for Charlie Coyle. Two points for Smith. Nothing for Felino. Three for Oscar Steen and nothing for Stud. Oof. Lindholm was fine. McAvoy was pretty good. Grizz. Oh, God. Carlo was fine. I mean, defensively and a net. Jeremy Swayman's save percentage jumped up to a 9 3 3. Oh, God. Guard controlling. From the old rock concert. One of the rock... Well, the first... Yeah, the second rock concert was in Toronto. <laughs> we'll be taking on, in round number two, the defending... How weird is that to say? The defending Stanley Cup champion Philadelphia Flyers. And look at that. We also get the Battle of Alberta. In round two, it's St. Louis and Vegas, the other Eastern matchup. New Jersey 
and Ottawa. The Bruins, on to round two. You'll love to see it. <laughs>